Hello, Radiant Ones. I'm about to turn it around. Um, I'm just going to be showing you my screen. Um, I'm going to be showing you my screen for this um, scope. It's going to be uh, 10 dynamic uh, tips to really, really get you thinking about why you may not be selling more online. So first of all, I want to know, uh, I need your help before we get into this. Um, I'm going to flip this around for a minute. I want you to get this screenshot for those of you who are here and those of you who are watching the replay. Go ahead and get the screenshot now uh, because you're going to want to have these links um, to connect with me. Okay, so great. Butterfly Fly, you're going to be my block ministry? Awesome. Thank you. Um, need a block ministry. I need a scribe to um, get down the aha moments, the takeaways. And the links who can be ascribed um, go ahead and let me know raise your hand uh, keep the hearts coming in the meantime if you're watching the replay you can go ahead and share with your followers um, um, okay hey Des let me know who can be my scribe if you're gonna jot down if you have a little bit of time um, to help me do the takeaways all right and also, thank you, Butterfly Fly. Thank you so much for inviting your followers. I want you all to introduce yourself by name, get to know each other. Um, and who else? Let me see. I need a scribe. I need someone to be on block ministry. Um, and I need a heart counter. Um, as our mentor, Danielle, uh, calls it, I need a heart counter to help me keep track of my next milestone. Um, okay, let's make it a heart party. That's what I'm talking about. Miriam. Okay. Um, Risa um, from Virginia Beach. Awesome. Um, let's see. How many hearts am I at? My goal, my next big milestone is 200K. Um, we hit the 100K mark. So I want everyone who watches this scope to give a love offering of one minimum 1K hearts. Okay. You do that by... Um, Go ahead, double tap in the screen, double tap in the screen, get that 500, hop out, come back in, and you'll have another 500. Let me say hello. Let me say hello to those of you who are new to my scopes. Hi, everybody. It's a little dark. That's okay. You can hear me. Um, and we want to keep baby girl sleeping, so we're going to keep the stimulation down for now. Uh, <laughs> I think you can see me just fine. I'm going to be sharing some great stuff with you tonight guys you want to watch you want to invite your followers hey Sonia how you doing oh god this heart attack I love it thank you everyone uh, let's get into this because I have a lot that I'm going to be sharing with you tonight we're going to be talking about 10 reasons why you're not selling more products or even services online okay uh, if you're a startup if you are a um, entrepreneur who has been blooming for a little while and you are wondering why um, you're not selling more, why you're not um, bringing in the revenue that you desire, I'm going to shed some light on that. Um, and for those of you who are newer to my scopes, um, I have been an, a business owner uh, since the year 2000. And I say that a lot, but I never really have a whole lot of time to go into um, some of the details. And people ask me, what do I do, what do I do? And then I got to run or the baby's crying. <laughs> so tonight, let's hope that I can um, give you a little bit more background on that. But um, I have been there in the beginning as a startup, having products, wondering why. That's right. Be social. Be social. Get to know everyone. Build your network. Thank you, Sonia, uh, for the greeting. Um, and, you know, you want to you make something fabulous or you have something dynamic to offer and by way of a solution and you wonder why you're not making enough sales, you know. So that is one of the big reasons why I created the Sales Mastery eCourse. Number one, why I work with clients and even why I'm doing Radiant Living, um, Radiant Biz, Radiant Startup, which you see me scoping on now. Many of you may know me from my beauty brand, Indigo Fair Beauty. Um, Des was actually one of my clients for that business in Philly, uh, and I actually started her locks in about the year. You can help me, uh, Des, and I'm, I'm sure you probably know the year. Uh, 2000, it's 2016 now. I'm going to guess and say 2008, and tell me if I'm right, Des. 2008, I got it, I got it, I got it, see? <laughs> but um, all right, everybody. 
everybody who's here, please invite your followers on Twitter. Um, you can swipe your screen from left to right or up to down. Up, you know, from, I'm sorry, down to up or uh, left to right. Uh, if you're on an iPhone. Um, and if you are on uh, Team Android, I think it's, um, you swipe up. All right. And uh, let's see. Let's get on into this. On Twitter, on Facebook, I think if you have, hey, how you doing, XM Culture? I watched your scope um, about the incense yesterday. Everybody go ahead, follow each other. Um, I, I'm loving to see all my regular uh, hashtag Team Radiant Biz. Go ahead, everybody. Um and drop that hashtag Team Radiant Biz. Uh, drop that there so everyone who's um, I see so many regulars here tonight. So thank you all. All right, I'm gonna flip the screen around because this is gonna be kind of like a show and tell scope, and I'm gonna show you a little bit of um, behind the scenes into um, one of my stores online uh, for Indigo Fair Beauty, and this is gonna be how I demonstrate. We're going to get into the principles a little bit later, but I'm going to show you uh, why some of this is so important. You're still reading the affirmations. Awesome. Great. Wonderful. Um, and let me give you a screenshot one more time for those of you who are not following me on Instagram. Um, make sure you do so. Um, and you're going to want to have this link later. I want to tell you guys one thing. Um, I'm going to be sharing a exclusive Periscope offer on this scope only and you're going to want to stay till the end to get it okay i'm not going to even show it i'm going to just keep double tapping the screen while i look <laughs> keep double tapping the screen um it's good a lot of positive it's a good thing it's a lot of positive but believe me when this negative one comes oh she she let me have it <laughs> she let me have it um, all right, all right, let's see, going through a lot of reviews here, okay, let me see, oh, 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 it was something else I would have loved to, okay, gosh, okay, For those of you who are just coming in, bear with us. I'm looking for something that I can show you. Uh, where is it? Oh, boy. Here it is. Here it is. <laughs> here it is. Okay. Here is the negative review. Now, let me show you. Let me show you how this same box um, didn't do well, the Indulge Me Beauty box. Okay. All right, here we go. Now, this client, she ordered, this is in 2012, I'll never forget this. I was working a travel nursing assignment, and it's funny because she's an RN too. I was working a travel nursing assignment, and I was away um, from where, you know, I, I manufactured my products, and um, I just, I wasn't, it wasn't as accessible to me, right? So... Um, let me tell you, she ordered the same thing, the Indulge Me Beauty Box that I mentioned earlier. Now, remember, when I made this product available, now if you click on it now, it's probably going to say product not available. Um, so you won't be able to see the, the description, but I know that I was very clear um, about, you know, what this product, what this set included or didn't include or whatever, right? Um, to basically say it's like a mixed gift box, okay? So she says, not going to lie, I was hoping to get the souffle or hair dressing, but the hair milk does make my hair very soft. I could I could do without the lemongrass scent, though. Overall, I would buy the products here again. Okay, so she says, not going to lie, she was hoping for a certain thing, all right? So she paid uh, the lower price, hoping for something. But let me tell you a little, a something that I did that... Um, that I think was not good. If you notice the picture that I used, I pictured some items, specific items, okay? However, it was a mixed box. Now, the first time I listed this, I didn't use that picture. It was more of a general picture. 
Um, so be careful and make sure that what you show in a picture is as closely uh, reflective of what it is that they're going to get and expect, okay? Be very careful about that. I was not trying to be misleading, but I probably just posted that quickly because it was a good picture, it was clear, and, you know, um, it, it made her think, oh, maybe I'm going to get those things, okay? So now, she already had a bad taste in her mouth because of that, so now look at this. So sh she um, orders again, okay? She orders again. Um, in December so let me tell you I was on a travel nursing assignment and I had my online store so for those of you who are you know starting a business you still working your nine to five trying to multitask guess what I missed this order I overlooked it came through and I didn't see the alert and when I did that I talked to this I talked about this before well let me show you her review first before I get into the whole story so she says I tried to give this vendor a second try, but there have been many, too many issues that I can no longer overlook. The long shipping times are my biggest problem. The first time I ordered, I was told my order was going to ship by a certain time, and then I was told the shipping was delayed, and then I was told my item was shipped days before it had not. Uh, this time I ordered my item, blah, 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 never again will I buy. So anyway, she is pissed, okay? Uh, way too long for an item even if it's handmade uh, I'm even more upset than my order now listen this is a key thing she ordered um, two two jars of something that was four ounces right and it was likely that I had I was out of stock of those four ounce jars and I put it in one eight ounce jars probably assuming that it was all for her and she says that she planned on gifting the other item to a family member. She was pissed. <laughs> she asked, did I respond? Of course I responded, right? I responded and I even offered because I always, anytime, you know, I drop the ball, my policy is that I'm going to make it right, okay? I'm going to make it right anytime I drop the ball. So... Um, this is like in 2012. I can't tell you exactly what I did, but I think at this point I offered to refund her money, okay? Uh, do whatever. I mean, it's been times that I've get, given clients a Target gift card for $10. Like, anything I can do to make it right, you know, I was like, I remember the day that I saw this. So you can see how long it is. I was at work on night shift, and I was like, oh, my God. <laughs> like, No. I was like, could you see how many positives I had, right? Fast shipping, the products are excellent. I'm just like, oh my God, is there any way that I can? And on Etsy, you can't do anything about this, right? I mean, it's like, really, I'm just letting you know. I mean, when you put yourself out there and you're a brand and you're a business, nobody cares I was on a travel assignment. Nobody cares. I still had to, I still had it up and somebody bought it and I did and was rushing around I was distracted again I probably wanted to hurry up and get the order out so I probably saw that it was late already sent her what I had didn't want to wait said oh it was just bad okay it was bad <laughs> so that's why you have to have your systems together I'm gonna be sharing the tips and the things that you need to do to make sure that this does not happen to you okay I have a video I did um, this on my Radiant Living Facebook um, group and it's a um, how to ship your products online cost effectively I don't know the whole title of it but it's a dynamic yes let me tell you this I mean <laughs> it did not feel good and this is still up here to this day like you said if you scroll back you can find it right um, and I've just um, and what can I say? You got to own it, right? Things happen. Um, but And she wouldn't even respond. She was pissed. You know, hey, how you doing, uh, Marjorie? Yes, Lioness. Um, I need make sure my block ministry is paying attention for when it needs to be, um, uh, when it needs to happen. You guys know what to do. So anyway, um, yeah, that was real, right? So <laughs> because of that, Again, because I fell my way forward, I'm like, this will not happen to me again. Um, you know, and I put things in place to make sure that didn't happen. 
um, if that meant even taking products down when things were when I was unavailable or whatever just for my integrity because it'll happen just when you with just when you um hope that just when you think that um something that's what's popping blocked <laughs> anyway anyway thank you so much Risa for being a scribe yeah um anyway guys um <laughs> I got distracted but let me keep moving let me keep moving I want to start getting into some of these tips for those of you who are just joining we're talking about 10 reasons why you're not selling more online okay and uh, my name is Chanel Washington and I am the owner of Integral Fair Beauty I'm a startup expert sales trainer and author of Radiant Living I am sharing some of my um, you know the the experience that I've had my even my mistakes my embarrassing moments dropping the ball um and the things that i've done right so that you can sell more in your business okay um and i want to make sure that you hang in there to the end of this scope because i'm going to have a special exclusive offer for my periscope family only um as it relates to the sales mastery e-course you're going to want to make sure that you stick around and listen okay so that was some of the negative. Okay, I can't I can't leave on that on, on that note. I gotta come back and show you. <laughs> the other good reviews. Let's get to some of the more recent ones. Uh that was going back as far as we started in two thousand nine, right? So even more recently, all right. Uh this is for the organic hair souffle. Um um now you can see even some of this was a pre order. You can always put something as a pre-order. If you know your product is not ready yet, um, you can still make sales, all right, when you have the right strategy, the right branding, more things that I'm going to talk about um, as a pre-order. You see that? Um, so you're clear about when they can expect a shipping date, you know, and all of that good stuff so it's no misunderstanding. So this person says, the owner was extremely nice and I love my new products. My hair felt so smooth and soft after just one application. You notice that is a recurring theme with the Indigo Fair products. After just one application, they notice um, results. So keep the hearts coming, family. I will definitely order more of this in the future, right? They keep saying that. It's a recurring. Um, back, this was in 2016, and in 2009, they said the same thing, right? Tammy, this is a regular client of mine. Um, she has a Neo Soul perfume refill. Um, I did it as a refill, um, free shipping. Uh, I'll talk more about that in my course on how you can make that work for your business. My go-to scents for years, okay? Um, just with this, the link to the course, um, it is bit.ly. Let me come back here for a minute. Make sure you screenshot this bit.ly forward slash radiant sales and that will take you to my Etsy shop for radiant living where you will get access to my um, seven module sales mastery um, e-course okay with audio trainings um, I'm giving you my swipe files of what it is um, that allowed me to be successful and know exactly what to say, what not to say, um, and how to attract your ideal clients. All right, so let me come back to the shop. All right, so here we're back in 2006. I love how the products make my hair feel. Um, great smelling oil. This is person, amazing product and owner. Chanel is kind and thoughtful. Okay, so you see when people are um, when people are buying online, you know, they want to know you. They want to trust you. Can I trust this person? She refers to me by my first name. That's always great, right? To let you know, person know that, wow, even if something does go wrong, it's really a person here. I'm not just sending my money out into, you know, cyberspace um, with nothing, you know, to show for it. Here is another example of how I'm selling info products. Okay, this is an inspirational message, audio book, and bundle. All right, um, so many things that you can do online. So for those of you who want to be authors, who are coaches, 
um, you can sell your info products online as well. I teach you how to do all these things with the Sales Mastery eCourse. Um, let me see. Anything else worth? Okay, this is really dope. The best natural hair moisturizer I have ever tried. My curls love it. That's an awesome, like, one-liner. Uh, this is Etsy.com um, that I am using. I've had several online stores, several e-commerce stores. Um, I know the pros and cons of several. Um, and would love to hear any tips you have on increasing Etsy increasing traffic to Etsy well um oh god did my whole thing die oh god y'all hold on I may have to come out and come back actually no I don't we just don't look at Etsy anymore um my connection died for a minute but what I'm gonna do um somebody asked about Somebody asked about tips for increasing um, traffic to sales to Etsy. Um, I have a whole course on Sales Mastery. It's not just one particular thing. Um, Etsy charges 20 cents per listing, okay? Um, because you can have tips, but if you don't have a full grasp of the sales process, if you don't know what, uh, if you don't have strategy in place, um, you don't know how to position your product right a few tips is just not going to do the trick okay to be honest that's why I created this course so you want to hang on and learn more I'm going to give you 10 reasons why you're not selling uh, more products online okay I'm going to read these tips for you and we can talk about it um, I am a um, startup expert and sales trainer this is my business this is another business that I have um, as an author as a trainer as a consultant you're welcome and I have products um, and services that you can invest in for your business because as you can see I've been doing this for a long time and I've um, paid my dues and um, invested in my business and I'd be happy to support you and share uh, what I know Matter of fact, it's already done. You know, it's already the work is already done. Uh, but you can work with me, have access to me um, in this when you order the Sales Mastery e course in a private online group. You get seven um, training modules that are audio lessons that are just out of this world if you ask me I created them even um, when I was on Periscope and pregnant this summer um, I pushed out and got that course finished so I knew that when my baby girl came and my time would be limited I wanted to have something ready for you for people like you who asked that question um, so that you could just go ahead and make the investment and learn what you needed to learn it comes with PDFs worksheets um, I give you my exact swipe files that I use so when people are inboxing me questions about my product um, you can see step by step in the conversation what I do to close the sale okay so was that helpful if so um, raise your hand give me some emotion cons let me know if that was helpful okay we're gonna get into it um, 10 reasons you're not selling more products online all right I wonder if I should do this as a part two guys what do you think um, is Etsy good? Um, it's all about, again, it's all about Etsy can sell anything. It's just a matter if you have what it is that you need, okay, um, to be able to attract the clients who want, need, and are willing to pay for it. But if you don't, um, you won't make the sales. There are plenty of Etsy shops out there who don't sell. Um, you can sell your products, you know, um, I help my clients be able to, <laughs> your Android, so no emotion cons. Oh, boo, boo. <laughs> boo, no, no emotion cons. How you live with no emotion cons? Anyway, <laughs> I'm just teasing you, but Sonia, um, I was able to sell my products over the phone. I can sell over a text message, over an email, face-to-face at an event, at a trade show, and have those clients come back to me over and over and over again. So whether it's Etsy, there's a reason why I use Etsy now, um, and I won't get into that too much um, in this scope, but um, it, Etsy may be the right platform for you, but it may not. Um, um, you know, 
so for years I had my standalone e-commerce store for Indigo Fair Beauty but um, as I changed direction you know I don't I took that down so it just depends on where you are with your business um, and being able to it's no cookie cutter you know one size fits all for everybody okay remember that and um, that's why um, the f starting from the very first module, when you get this, you'll, you know, the light bulb will go off and you'll be able to use it over and over and over again to customize it for your, your business. Okay. Um, there you go. So 10 reasons you are not selling more products online. Let's get started. Number one, <sighs> the first reason is you, you don't have enough testimonials. That's why I got it off, got off you know, showing you the importance of those testimonials on that store, okay, for Indigo Fair Beauty. And you can see, you know, just uh, as a potential buyer, you know, how you feel reading those type of reviews, all right? Um, you can tell they're authentic. You can tell I didn't pay somebody to write that. You know what I mean? They come from real clients. Because let me tell you, as a business owner, people do do buy reviews. They are, there are sites out there because I outsource a lot of work for virtual assistants and there's people that's trying to sell you. Let me get you a thousand likes and let me come write comments on your blog. Let me, people will do anything for a dollar, you know. So you want to make sure that you're positioning yourself and you know how to earn those testimonials. I earn those testimonials for my brand. So it allows me um, to continue to um, get people to shop with me over and over and over again. Um, like my last clients are helping me get new clients. Okay. So the, if you don't have those, that is one reason why you may not be selling more products online. Okay. Um, so if you know you need more testimonials, say me, throw your hands up, give me a motion kind for uh, team Apple. <laughs> And if you are on Android, you just got to say me. You just got to type it in, okay? So if you know you need more testimonials in 2016 for your business or your startup, let me hear you say me. All right, number two. The second reason, okay? <laughs> the second reason. What's the question mark, Des? What's the question mark? And, and let me know if you're a team Apple or if you're a team Android. Let me know. Okay, Sonia. Sonia knows she needs more. Awesome. Um, it's possible for you. Absolutely. Number two, your photos are not eye-catching enough. Your photos are not um, polished and professional. When you're selling product, um, you want to get that the best branding, the best graphics, the best visual um, branding as possible. So... Um, my labels, you know, creating a product from creating the product labels to the packaging to the actual photo styling itself. Um, that is very key. So if uh, you know you need that for your business, you need that visual uh, branding, do you need to um, be able to be more compelling um, from a visual standpoint? Stay me. Put your emotion kind of hand up. Let me see you for number two. Um, if that's you, that's where you are in your business. For those of you who are new to the scopes, thank you so much. You can follow me um, here on Periscope and Twitter. It's at Radiant Living underscore. Um, and on Instagram, it's at Radiant Living Biz, B I Z. And um, if you. If you know you need to contact me, reach out to me. I'm available. Contact at radiantliving.biz if you have questions um, about the Sales Mastery eCourse. And um, to get to that course and learn more about it, um, it is an instant download. You will have it as soon as you order it. Um, and you will get my formula that I've learned over these years to be able to master sales. Um, and that's how I train other entrepreneurs to be able to sell more, double their sales, attract the ideal clients, automate their marketing um, so that it's effortless, it's easy, and you don't have to be scared um, of selling or feeling like you're pushing people, you know, um, to sell anything. All right. You're actually just solving problems. All right. So here we go. Number three. Another reason, the third reason why you're not selling more products online is your brand is not compelling enough, all right? Um, Indigo Fair Beauty, I love, I love, I love, I'm so blessed, you know, to be able to have that brand name. Um, 
it's just an experience. It's a, it's a, it's a philosophy, you know. Um, you know, the way my clients greet each other, you know, the way I greet them, the way I sign, sign off, you know, be radiantly beautiful. Um, they know what to expect, you know, from the branding uh, to the packaging to when they call my voicemail to if they see me at a trade show, um, how they're received, the service that they get. That's all part of the brand. If your brand is not compelling enough, you're not going to sell more, especially online because people don't have the in-person, you know, benefit of being able to te see it, touch it, smell it, feel it. Uh, so your branding really has to be as strong as possible. Um, and if it's not, then you're just not going to reach those revenue goals that you have uh, for your business or your startup. Okay. If you know that that's where you are uh, with your branding and you need to um, tighten it up, say me. Um, put your hand up. Let me see. Um, and Gabriel Cameron, tell me your first name. I don't know if, it, if that's your first name. Um, that's Des is saying that's where she is with branding. Um, I would love to be able to support you with that um, in this course, okay? Um, there's so many opportunities online to be able to um, make your brand shine and consistent. Um, and if you don't know these things, if you don't know these inside um, strategies and have these skills, you're going to end up overpaying. You're going to end up... Um, I told this whole story about a whole website nightmare. I might say that for another day. But um, I ended up, you know spending um this is back in about the same time about the same time i met you Des, when i had this studio it was a little earlier than that maybe 2006 to make a long story short i in 2006 i paid paid 1500 dollars for a website that you know someone uh the company that i hired you know, I had no control over my site. My site was locked up. I couldn't make changes. It looked gorgeous, but I couldn't sell anything. And, um, you know, it's so many ways that you can accomplish that compelling brand for pennies on the dollar. Okay, so no longer was I ever in that situation. I always feel my way forward, like I said. And uh, you don't have to make those mistakes. I've already made the mistakes. So um, smart, savvy entrepreneurs do not try to reinvent the wheel. They learn from others, okay? So keep that in mind. Number four. Number four. Okay, you are trying to serve everyone. You're trying to serve everyone and you're not doing justice to anyone <laughs> as a result okay um so that's why another reason why you're not getting the sales you want there is a cut a client if you've done your homework if you have the right information uh thank you risa um you will be serving a specific niche a specific segment of a market you know and really get that market share and again people want to come back again and again uh, when when they know that what you have solves their problem in an excellent way um, when they are um, relating to your brand when they feel could that connection um, and they you you exceed their expectations um, you know you don't have to um, you don't have to struggle to get those kind of clients. You know, they're going to tell their friends, okay? And they're going to keep coming back. So that's going to help your business grow, give you the money that you need to reinvest in your business, to grow your business. And uh, it doesn't have to take, um, you know, a million years for that to happen. Um, it, it, it's very, very doable, but you have to do the work. You have to have the foundational um, knowledge and skills as it relates to sales, um, and the way that I teach it is a step-by-step -step, uh, system. I give you so many key examples. You see, I like to tell my stories and um, break things down. Yes, absolutely. Um, because trying to serve everybody will leave you frustrated and you won't be making any sales. Okay? All right, great. So, let's see. Number five, number five, um, another, f the reason, the fifth reason that you're not selling enough online is because the clients that you do have, 
the sale you have made, they're not coming back. Those clients are not coming back. And there's specific reasons why they're not coming back. It's not always because they're not satisfied. Um, there's some reasons why. And I'm going to help you be able to stay connected with those clients um, so that they can't forget you. Okay, so you'll be an unforgettable brand and you'll be first to mind uh, when they need this um, product or service again. Okay, so that's key. If you have clients and you know that you need to keep them coming back in 2016, say me. All right, if you want to um, have the type of clients that um, continue to think of you first when they need um, the product or service that you offer, say me. Okay, absolutely. Um, not with con connected with clients where we repeat sales, we lose that connection. Um, I have a story that I tell. Um, and about uh, one of my first products that I made, and I do have a pro the organic hair souffle now. I figured I'd pull it out um, so you can see it's a real thing. <laughs> this is my best selling product, the Indigo Farrah organic hair souffle. And I know I'm showing it up, whatever you call it, backwards because I'm not flipping the camera around, but you get the gist. This is the best selling uh, product that I've created, all right, as far as um, my plant-based um, beauty brand but I started out with body care products that's a hair care product and let me tell you this story um, as it relates to clients not coming back I sold uh, I did a show it was an open mic um, poetry event that I used to do back in the day in Philly and it was down near the University of Penn area if anybody's in Philadelphia you know you'll know this area um, and what was the name of this place oh my gosh what was the name of that place? They used to have all kind of events there. I can't read. The name escapes me right now. But um, anyway, I was there in an event and I was vending. It was one of my first vending events. And um, I had something called Fresh Pineapple Body Butter. And I talk about this in my book. Um, I talk about it in uh, my, my book, um, The Indigo Fair Beauty Book, which you can get on the Etsy shop as well. Um, Fresh Pineapple Body Butter. And I sold it in a four ounce, no, I sold the first product in an eight ounce jar. So it was double, double of what you see this is, right? Sold it in an eight ounce jar. And it was awesomely soft and moisturizing. The scent was just alluring and sweet and ripe and juicy and wonderful. And um, I had this client, she was, uh, she bought it. She was actually a security guard that worked at this place. So I sold it a product and came back, like, I don't know if it was a full 12 months later, but like another, you know, for another event, maybe six months later, maybe nine months later, I don't know what it was, but it was a significant amount of time that passed. So she came over to my table and she said, um, you know, I was like, oh, you know, how's everything? You know, how do you like the product? She actually was like, oh my God, I'm so glad you're here. I'm so glad you came back. She opened up her purse and pulled out the jar of Indigo Farah Fresh Pineapple Body Butter. And let me tell you, she was using it <laughs> like she would never get another jar in her life, okay? It was just like she just was holding on to it. Welcome, everybody. It's just coming in. Uh, this is 10 reasons why you're not selling more products online. So she was just using this... Uh, uh, product like you know it was just the most precious thing to her so she loved the product but I was wondering to myself well why hadn't she bought any more <laughs> like why hasn't she bought any more so uh, I realized that I did not stay in touch with the woman okay it's your job to stay in touch with the clients for um, their, it's not their job for them to find you okay people are busy and this was back in the day and they can imagine now with all the distractions on social media and everything going on, so many other things competing for people's attention. You have to know how to stay connected in the best way, uh, in the most effective way to do that, to build that relationship and make you top of mind, right? Okay, because think about how many things you love, but you just forget about it. You just forget about it, right? Um, it's, it's not always that you didn't like it, right? How should we stay in contact? 
that's what I teach you in the course. <laughs> that's what I teach you in the course. And guys, I'm not being evasive, but you all know I, um, many of you who are here, you've taken the, um, freemium that I've offered, which is the, um, Radiant Living uh, seven day online startup challenge. For those of you watching the replay, I offered something, um, I guess at the end of December, early January, called the seven day online startup challenge, right? And um, it was a freemium. I offered this for just your name and email, and I gave seven days of dynamic content, teaching, and um, action steps for you. Um, and those of you who are there, welcome back. Um, Welcome back, yes, Linus. Everybody follow Marjorie. Um, so that was free. But everything that you need to get for your business is not that's going to be worthwhile. You have to make the investment. So I am a business owner. Um, I am a businesswoman. I am an entrepreneur. And I value what it is that I know. I've showed you, um, you know, the track record that I've had. And, you know, that's just, hey, hey, love. How you doing? <laughs> Glad to see you here. This is a dynamic entrepreneur. Um, check out her business. Follow her. Yes, Lioness. Um, uh, she has um, some awesome, awesome art. She's an illustrator. And she did something really unique. Um, and it's an adult coloring book called The Empowered Goddess. I did a video on it. Um, so go ahead and follow Marjorie, everybody. She has some awesome um, sweatshirts and different things, arts, cards um, that empower black women and celebrate women of color. Um, yes, lioness, all right? So anyway, I was saying, Des, um, this course... Um, I'm giving you some insight. I'm giving you some things to think about. But now it's time to start to train, okay? Um, train and get the things. I love you right back. Get the things that you need um, for your business. Let me have you know who, um, I'm not even finish all the tips, but if you know, based on what you've heard so far, based on the scopes that you've um you know, receive from me since you've been following me, you know, how, how many people are going to take advantage, you know, of this Radiant Sales course is the seven, uh, seven modules. So you can see the CDs here because that reflects the audio. So you get audio that you can open up on your laptop, on your smartphone, um, and then you get a supporting PDF worksheet document um, that's going to give you all the answers that you need step by step to be able to double your sales, um, to know exactly how not to let those clients slip away. All right, how to create that compelling brand, and then you will have support from me in a private email. I'm sorry, in a private group um, online uh, where you can ask those questions, and then you'll get the clear answer because you've made the investment and shown that you um, are a serious, savvy entrepreneur and you value what it is um, that I have as far as this solution. So, um, those are the levels and how I can help you. I help people on different levels. Um, so when you access me, you know, um, on Periscope, you'll get a certain level of knowledge. But um, when you make an investment um, into one of the training courses, you'll get a different level um, of access to what it is that. Does that make sense? Does that make sense, Des? Let me know uh, if it does because guess what? I'm going to train you to do the same thing. You can't give away everything that it is that you have. If not, you're not in business. If not, it's a hobby, right? Um, you have to value what it is, right? Absolutely. So you as um, the dynamic um, travel consultant that you are, I learned more about your business and what you do, right? You help people save time. Essentially, that's really what you're doing. You're helping them save time and time is money. So you have to value what it is that you do and, um, you know, can't give everything away for free. So that's, you know, on that note, um, if you know that this is something that's right for you, I would love to be able to um, see you flourish, right, from taking this Radiant Sales course. Absolutely. You know, um, it's, this is like kind of like my best work so far. I took the time to give you um, each module. Um, it's In, in what it is that I'm sharing, but I didn't want to make it too, too long because I know people have so much to do. So I tried to aim for about 20 minutes for each audio. 
So you'll be able to listen to it, listen to it again, listen to it again as many times as you, as you need to. You have access to it for a lifetime. It's not like something that I'm going to take down there, downloads that you'll own once, once you make the investment um, in the course. Um, and uh, you'll also have the worksheets and you'll have uh, access to me in the group, um, in a group setting, in a Facebook group. You'll also have access to other entrepreneurs um, to help you in this um, in this course. So let me get back to the reasons. Where were we? What number did I stop at? Number four, trying to serve everyone. Okay. Um, and you, oh, your clients are not coming back. That was number five. So I told you my little story about the fresh pineapple body butter. And it's another lesson in that. But again, that's a little bit more. It goes into the course. Um, uh, and it has to do with uh, the amount that I sold her. But anyway, uh, number six. Number six, your marketing is outdated, okay? Another reason is um, your marketing is outdated. You're not up to speed doing the best practices um, as far as um, communicating your brand value, all right? And uh, one of the reasons uh, why I commit to uh, be on Periscope Monday through Friday, right? Despite the fact that my daughter is... Um, a young baby and I'm a, a new mommy first time mommy you know I work around it and many of you see me scoping in the car scoping in the dark <laughs> scoping and do whatever I have to do right um, because um, this is a powerful medium this is um, the future this is current right now um, everybody's not on Periscope well thank you Risa <laughs> everybody's not right um, but um, I take advantage of, of what is trending and what is working and what is effective, right, um, to reach my ideal clients, right, and uh, position myself as an expert. So uh, it takes some work, but you want to make sure that the marketing that you're doing, um, you know, there's so many changes that have taken place in Facebook. Um, that you need to be knowledgeable about that. It's still a way to use Facebook, but it can't be the be-all, end-all that I made a Facebook post and I'm expecting my sales to blow up. It's not going to work like that, right? Okay? <laughs> you have to catch the replay. Awesome. That's that's totally fine, you know? Catch the replay because I do scope um, very, very early in the morning on some days. So, yes, make sure you're following me and always come back and catch the replay and share your heart. So, I appreciate you. Um... Okay. <laughs> oh my gosh, I'm not even supposed to say a word. <laughs> I love Periscope. If you if you're not here live, then you just you just you just miss out. I can't. <laughs> I can't even say anything right now. <laughs> anyway. Anyway. Number seven. Okay, another reason why you're <laughs> you're not selling more products online um, is that your social media is inconsistent. Your social media is inconsistent, and let me tell you, with Angelo Fair Beauty, um, social media was really the way that I was able to. Um, grow that business, you know, because I didn't do a lot of advertising. I didn't even, I really slowed down even going to a lot of the shows and doing things, but I learned how to automate my social media. And um, that really is something I touch on in this course, but I don't go in deep, deep, deep detail because that's another course. Um, and it's about social media automation. Um, and uh, I have some mini courses as well that I offer. Um, and those are going to be like some of those bite-sized um, focused lessons that I teach about social media mastery and how to uh, automate that so it's consistent because, you know, life happens and you can't do everything. You should not be working, um, you know, in your business anyway. You should be working on your business. I have hired virtual assistants since, goodness gracious, um, at least for the past six years I've worked. Uh, wor welcome, Coach Leela. How are you? Welcome, welcome. So so glad to have you here. This is 10 Reasons Why You're Not Selling More Products Online. 
and I'm um, glad to have you. Um, so, like I said, working with social, working with virtual assistants. Um, if you have uh, still have a day job, if you are a mommy, if you have just other commitments, you know, a spouse, and you don't need to be on social media all day and night. You need to be, um, you know, growing, operating your business from a strategic standpoint creating your intellectual property, creating your products, you know, whatever it is that you do. Um, but um, there is a way to do your social media, a bulk of it, you know, in advance so that you can free up your time, all right? So um, make sure you have a plan for that. If you don't, you know, I'd be happy to help you with that as well with one of the mini courses. Um, but it is a part of... Um, of sales on uh, social media it's not everything again these are all pieces that work together okay um, welcome back Des and number where are we is this eight my numbers got all mixed up guys is this number eight I think this is number eight um, a number another reason why your products are not selling well thank you thank you Lisa um, selling is that your products aren't performing they're not doing what they're not all that great <laughs> Simply, right? Make sure your product is excellent. Okay? If you're going to, it's like go big or go home, right? This product, um, Indigo Fair Organic Hair Supply, let me flip this camera around so you can see it. You've seen the testimonials, okay? You've seen the testimonials. Get a screenshot of that. Oh, you guys are not supposed to see my notes in the background, but. <laughs> Go big or go home, right? I can be proud of this product, right? Um, I I became a mommy and I said, you know, I'm going to, um, all right. And I said, I'm going to scale back, you know, with this business. Um, but guess what? Now, even though I'm not offering my full collection and all my energy is not on Indigo Farah, I still have a loyal following of clients that now, guess what? When I sell this, and you can go to the Etsy shop and see, and you saw that that review, now I sell two at a time. You can't even buy one. You have to buy two at a time because the demand is there. I know it's awesome. I know it's effective. I have people that said it. It's not just me saying it. Other people are saying it. Absolutely, right? And the product is effective. So step your game up. If you are you know creating a product if you're the creator like marjorie yes lioness her products are awesome it's unique you know it's not something that you can just get anywhere right if you're doing a service you see me i'm trying to all not trying i'm always perfecting my craft craft you don't know behind the scenes i'm in class too you know i sell classes but i'm in class right so i'm always raising my raising the bar for myself make sure you step your game up you know whether it be your packaging um everything tying together make an investment this course the sales mastery e-course is going to help you serve your clients better you know um get the training that you need all right don't 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 play small um don't settle right absolutely Risa. thank you so much i'm so glad this is like you know this is what i love to do and i haven't been able to come in and spend this time with you guys in a little while so um i really really i love it and thanks for being here <laughs> so um yeah you know be excellent be excellent at what you do and again going back to that client client care oh thank you so much thank you i appreciate you um to god be the glory to god be the glory um you know, going back to that client care, your excellence, even when you're not perfect, because guess what? I've dropped the ball sometimes. I've made mistakes as, as I've shown you, but make sure that you stand by. You always make it right. That's the way I say it. Say, put that in the comment spot. Always make it right. Always make it right. Even when you may drop the ball, right? Or a product didn't come out exactly right, or it got damaged in the mail, or the shipping was late, or even if it's something that you're doing, you know, and you deliver um, services. I've had a client, I've had um, someone that, uh, a coach I worked with one time on, and um, she, uh, people make mistakes. We were scheduled to get together on the call um, at a certain time, and she wasn't on the call, you know. And, you know, things happen. Things happen, you know.
know. Um, she could let me hang out. I think she should have kind of did something and kind of make up for it a little bit. You know, she did. And so you want to exceed people's expectations. You're human. Give yourself room to be human. You know, but have uh, the mindset. Don't, don't, don't think small-minded and like, oh, I'm going to lose money, you know, if I replace this or I refund. Let me tell you something. Anytime I ever drop the ball, you, 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 you better hope I drop the ball because I'm like giving you <laughs> everything with the kitchen sink and giving you like, try not to always give me money back. If I had I me, mean, if I really, really screwed up, I've given, offered a refund, but I'm giving extra product. I'm giving you coupon codes for the rest of your life. I'm like, please, I'm sorry. You know, I, I truly value you. And my clients, those clients, I'm telling you, one of the clients that made one of those um, posts, I remember I dropped the ball with her. I sent that lady a, a Target gift card. I mean, it was only $10, but it was an e-card that same night. I'm like, what can I do, right? What can I do to um, let her know that I value this business? It's not about, you know, that 20 something dollar one-time order. This is a lifetime, right? I want you for a lifetime. So, um just keep that in mind, you know, your excellence, you know, with product, your service, make sure you're performing, um, just make sure, all right? So, um, who is this? Let me see. Okay, home business owner, residential real estate, Cephas Edwards. Okay, Cephas, how you doing? Uh, thanks for being here. Okay, so... How, does that make sense, everyone? If you are committed to always make it right, say me. Um, throw your hands up, give me an emotion kind, because that's something that I'm very, very big about, you know? Um, especially when I'm giving referrals, because I have a very large, not even so much large, but I have a, a pretty dope network of other entrepreneurs that I know, you know, um, I stand on my integrity, and, you know, my name means a lot to me, right? So... I refer people, and if I refer your business, make sure you do right. <laughs> you know what I mean? Make sure you're ready and prepared to deliver, right? You're performing. Your products are going to perform. You're going to perform. You're going to do what you say you're going to do. Be a person of integrity. That's a whole nother scope, but anyway, let me take a sip of water, guys. Hold on. Thank you. Yes, be prepared. Expect to sell. That's a whole nother scope. Expect to sell something. Reason why you're not selling product because you don't expect to sell. You don't really think anybody's going to buy anything. You're not expecting it. Let me tell you, I I have products on that same store. I have a product. Before I did this scope, I was scrolling on my phone. And we talk about this multiple streams of income. I sold an info product. It was only $7. But that's $7 I didn't have before. It was about how to start a holistic health um, business. Seven dollars. I'm marketing it. I'm marketing it. I have a, a virtual assistant doing marketing for me that I outsource. Okay, um, and uh, you know I see the sale. Seven dollars. Somebody bought it. I do the work one time and get paid over and over and over again. Those those revenues add up, right? So. Um, it's doable, but you have to have the right information. You have to um, know what it is because a lot of this is just through experience. It's through studying. It's through my own expertise. Everybody has their gift, right? Everybody has their gift. This is my gift. I love to help other entrepreneurs be able to sell. If you can't get your products in the hands of uh, those people that need it and want it, what, what good is your business, right? Would it just sitting sitting here reading okay great what are you reading what are you reading what are you reading Risa um you know what good is it right so I love to be able to help you break down those barriers overcome those challenges get rid of the fear of selling you know start to charge what you're worth and stop um you know um undervaluing yourself um, and being scared and thinking that your products aren't going to sell you know when you when you have the right knowledge and you do this um, in a way that is a best practice that's proven over and over again you know I didn't I didn't invent sales you know I'm just a student of sales and I've actually walked the walk so now I um, want to help
help you do the same thing, right? Okay, continue to learn by reading. Absolutely, you have to study. You have to be a student. You have to be a lifelong learner. Everybody that's um, come through my uh, Radiant Living Startup Challenge, they know we're lifelong learners, you know? And and you can, and I can, and I can see it in you. You, you. you just turn into a whole different, you know, a different level um, of, for those of you who have been through the challenge, all right? Abundance now, okay, because it applies to being a good life coach. Absolutely, absolutely. Yes, yes, yes. That's Lisa. Lisa Nichols. I've actually um, trained with her at Speaking Right to Make Millions. I've mentioned this before. Um, dynamic, dynamic author and coach. So, um, let's see. Where are we? Number nine. We're almost finished. Um, number nine. Number nine reason why you're not selling more products online is because your ideal clients cannot find you. They can't find you. You might have the most awesome pound cake, you know, you might do, uh, you know, the best lock maintenance. You may have um, the best uh, handmade unique earrings or what it is. You might be the most awesome, you know, love and relationship coach. But which one were you LOLing? My pound cake? Which one were you <laughs> Which one were you laughing at, Risa? Um, <laughs> yeah. But if people can't find you, if you're just relying on your Facebook friends, the pound cake. <laughs> I must be hungry. <laughs> right? You know, you know people like that, right? With some awesome products and I, I was going to make an example but I'm not going to do it because people could be listening to me <laughs> gotta be careful with Periscope right but um, seriously I did I'm, I'm going to say I tasted something it was an edible item not, not, not calling anybody out edible item in the past week it was to die for okay it wasn't pound cake it was to die for so so awesome but, you know, this person, I don't even really know. They're ready to be in business. But um, can people find you? It doesn't matter how great it is. If you don't, if you're not selling it, right? Or if you, even if you're giving things away, you're not making money, you can't, you can't sell it again because you can't get more, right? If, if it's you, right? It ble absolutely. It blessed my life. It sure did. <laughs> Um, you know, if it's you, if you can't take care of yourself, you're a speaker, you're a coach, you're an author, right? You're a consultant, you're a trainer, and you have opportunities. You need to get, you know, I work with women. We need to look right. We need to get our hair done. We need to get our makeup. We need to have a suit. We need a new bag. We need shoes. We need everything. When you go out to events to speak to every. You got to take care of yourself, ladies. How are you going to do that, right? If you're not able to sell can't happen right so if your ideal client can't find you again people can find you but are there your ideal clients right that's one of the many courses that I teach I, um, I incorporate that into the sales course but I also go deeper in a specific one of the many courses right with radiant living so again if you're new to my scopes my name is Chanel Washington I appreciate you for being here uh, so delighted we're getting close to the end I have one more all right if you guys I, I'm just like it's, I've been doing this for a long time we've been almost like, probably an hour <laughs> let me stay focused let me stay focused number 10 I mean number 10 yes um, it's very timely okay final reason why you're not selling more product online is because you're doing too much and you're overwhelmed you are doing too much and you're overwhelmed this boils down to what just like I gave that example you saw when I got that review I got that bad review right because I didn't have systems in place to be able to handle that business right I was a victim of my own success so to speak I heard that on Shark Tank um, I, I did not properly delegate. Now, part of the reason was good. I was at my day job. I was making money. I was working. 
but it's no excuse. Nobody cares. You know, you put something up on sale, you say, this is what I do. You got to deliver, right? So I was doing too much and I was overwhelmed. If you're doing too much, you're doing the wrong things, you're distracted, you're focusing on low priority activities, you don't know what it is you should be doing to follow up with your clients to attract, continue to get those repeat sales, to continue to be able to ship online. Uh, you're not connected um, with the right group of people who are, um, you know, movers and shakers like you are, who you can learn from. I love to see how Risa and Des, they connected. They stay connected. They became accountability partners in the challenge. So, and um, I love to see how you ladies stay connected, right? And you're growing together. You keep moving forward. That's awesome. Um, so, doing too much, you're distracted. You're not going to be able to sell what you need to sell, right? So, let's do a quick recap. And then I'm going to give you the exclusive offer for the Sales Mastery course because you have stayed in here. Uh, you know, you have uh, hung for the whole time. And I'm going to make sure that you have this um, beast mode. That's what I'm talking about. <laughs> I like that. Beast mode. Okay. Here we go. The recap. 10 reasons why you're not selling more products online. You don't have enough testimonials. Number two, your photos are not eye-catching. Number three, your brand is not compelling. I know Risa can't type this fast, but I'm just doing a recap. Uh, number four, you're trying to serve everyone. Number five, <laughs> Your clients don't come back. This is like, nope, can't type that fast. Number six, your marketing is outdated. Number seven, your social media is inconsistent. Number 10, your ideal client can't find you. And finally, I'm sorry, number 10, number nine, your ideal client can't find you. And number 10, you're doing too much and you are overwhelmed, right? So you, if you know it's time to get rid of those reasons if you know it's time to get rid of those reasons and start selling in 2016 say me put up your emotion cons all right and i want to make sure that you have what you need i've already created it i've already done the work you guys know how i roll right <laughs> i'm prepared okay i come to class prepared so i'm going to make sure you write this down write this down and somebody get this in the comments for me right the code is Periscope 200, the number 200, Periscope 200, okay? With that coupon code, you will be able to take advantage of the Sales Mastery e-course. Exactly, Periscope 200. This is only until uh, the last day to take advantage of this is next the end of the month, the end of January, okay? Because I'm going to be introducing some more dynamic uh, programs. And I want you to have this. Those of you who are ready, uh, drum roll, yes. <laughs> Periscope 200. That course, the Sales Mastery e-course um, that I've been talking about throughout this entire scope, uh, the value of that course, <laughs> I mean, I honestly, I mean, thousands of dollars worth of value why because it's going to allow you to sell and make money um, avoid those mistakes have the exact uh, swipe files that i use okay um and save so much time and money and stop wasting time and money and start selling okay so the um link to get there is bit.ly forward slash radiant sales day from Australia. <laughs> right now, um, right now, this course on Etsy, the investment is $297, but because you have been here for this entire scope, all right, you get the $200 exclusive offer 
So what will your investment be for all my brainiacs out there? <laughs> you will get this uh, course for $97 for the seven modules, me teaching you, giving you all my good stuff in the audio format in addition to the resource guide, um, PDF worksheets, you're going to get access to me in a private Facebook group where I'm going to answer your questions, clarify things that you need, because why I want to see you successful. $97. Yes, that's right. Whatever that emotion kind is. <laughs> okay, so if you will be taking advantage of this, say me. If you're not going to let another week go by without having the tools that you need, um, to sell more online, the World Wide Web. I mean, I didn't tell you, we looked into some of the re reviews in my store, but that was just Etsy. That was not my online store that I've had, you know, the e-commerce shopping carts that I've had for years. Um, make sure you got that screenshot. Bit.ly forward slash radiant sales with an S. Put in the coupon code you're going to click on sales mastery e-course sorry that's what you're looking for sales mastery it says sales mastery e-course you'll see the same picture the same graphic it will match <laughs> it will say 297 dollars you'll add it to your shopping cart and you will uh save 200 dollars um on that course so your investment will be 97 dollars uh this will only be valid through January 31st 2016 so if you are listening to this scope at another time I want you to follow me on Instagram at Radiant Living Biz make sure you click the link in the bio for whatever is current so you stay connected with me um, but this will be over so um, be smart enough to take advantage of that because those of you have been listening to me um, you see what I offer on Periscope you see the level that I offer on Periscope on my freemiums um, I, I know I offer dynamic content and um, when you make that investment in your business and yourself um, I want to see everybody successful but when you sow a seed with me I'm going to make sure you're taken care of okay um, because let me tell you I've been in certain courses, several courses, um, with price points um, much higher than what it is that I'm offering to you tonight. And I see people that are left hanging, honestly, because they can't keep up um, and uh, they don't have all the pieces. You know, there's so many pieces as it relates to selling your products online, so many nuances, so many little tricks and secrets and did not even secrets but if you if you're just not familiar with it you just may feel lost and clueless so i see people get into programs they do it for a couple of weeks and then they drop out or they're quiet because they feel embarrassed and they feel lost and they feel and it's like that's unfortunate you know when you um are part of team radiant biz you know hashtag team radiant biz i'm gonna make sure that if i see you doing the work if you're committed you know, I'm going to do my best to support you um, and make sure that you're not, not lost. Um, but moving forward in 2016, I'm only going to get better. You know, I'm only going to keep continuing uh, to bring you more value. Yes, absolutely. Thank you so much, Risa. You've been a dynamic scribe tonight. Thank you so much. Um, because um, just uh, everything that I teach, you know, I walk the walk, guys. You know, I walk the walk. I'm not perfect. I'm not different than you. I just am dedicated. I'm dedicated. I have my why. I got my little girl in that room. And she is like, if you if you think, think I've been working before, like, <laughs> you know, just imagine once she gets a little bit older and I'll be freed up again a little bit. But, um, yes, you know, I, I just want to see you all um, really be able to manifest what it is that you're doing right um your business um it needs to be in the hands of those people who it's going to impact right so um don't make it difficult don't make it more difficult than it has to be i'm telling you this product 
um, this program, this training. Absolutely, I'm so uh, we think. <laughs> Right? I know. I know. This is excellent for her. She did a good job. I was timing like, oh, God, she going to go to sleep so I can get on and be able to do this training tonight. <laughs> we appreciate her, right? But um, I just, you know, I, I see those of you. I see those of you who, you know, you just have a few missing links. And she'll be up later for a while. Not really because she sleeps good at night. She sleep. I'm blessed with that. She'll pop up a little bit to eat, but she goes back to sleep. She goes back to sleep. Um, you know, I really want to see you all be success, be successful uh, faster. You know, I want to see you exceed what it is that, that I've been able to do. You know, um, you know, with the internet, I mean, <laughs> you know, your your success, your abundance can happen now, right? Right, we said right now. It doesn't have to be um, months and months and months and years and years and years. You know, um, if you're smart, you can learn from others that have been there and done that. Um, and they can tell you um, kind of the shortcut, the cliff notes uh, version, right, uh, as it relates to this. So the great thing about Sales Mastery is that you can use this again and again and again. It's going to apply to any business yes i do um welcome bright soul music i do i've uh, been in the beauty business you know um in this market in this industry but these principles that i'm teaching you are applicable um to um any industry all right and you can use it over and over again you'll have these downloads um welcome biz mom club and uh, you can accept access them and listen to them over and over and over again. Uh, and the great thing about um, this course, the way that I have it available right now, is that you will um, get it all instantly. You don't even have to wait, you know, so you do it at your own pace. Um, later in my future programs, you may get things spaced out um, a little bit longer. So while you want to go ahead and take advantage of that right now with that um, code Periscope 200, you got it. You, you missed it. You just come in and watch the replay. Um, the code to the course, um, I'm going to show it one more time before we wrap up. Bit.ly forward slash radiant sales with an S. Thank you so much for sharing. Um, I had a great time with you all tonight. I had a lot of fun, laughter. We talked about pound cake. We talked about <laughs> talked about a little bit of everything and had a great time. Um, but stay close. I have some awesome um, programs coming up. Um, I just keep keep um, <laughs> now you what's up right. Uh, keep bringing you uh, exactly what it is that you need to be able to increase your sales, to be able to attract your ideal clients, automate your marketing, um, and really start your business, um, you know, in a strategic, smart way so that you can uh, enjoy your success right now in 2016. Thank you so much for being here. Make sure you're following me so you can catch me for my next scope. And make sure you uh, have given your 1K hearts if you haven't. Jump back on, uh, catch the replay, and help me get to 200K with this scope, all right? Thank you all. I appreciate you. And you can still invite your followers if you are watching the replay on Facebook, on Periscope, and on Twitter. Be radiantly beautiful.